Despite what the sign says, you're really not all that welcome in Oregon, especially if you plan to stay. I think that uh, we may have to establish a policy. It's not going to be a policy of rudeness or having columnists insult people or having governors insult people, but uh, some kind of policy that uh, says at a certain point that this state has had enough. He was a hell of a man, taking a stand when something needed done. He was one politician who could make a decision, that's why he's our favorite son. From Astoria to Newport and up to Multnomah Falls, from 66 to 74, our governor was Tom McCall. I don't think they want us except for our money, really. <laughs> Do you blame them as a Californian? No, I don't. I think I'd feel the same way because with so many people from California coming to Oregon, it's going to ruin it. Every time I speak to a national convention that comes here, I greet them and I always say, come back many times and visit us again and again and enjoy the beauties of the state, but for heaven's sake, don't move here to live. I'm simply saying that Oregon is demure and lovely and it ought to play a little hard to get. And I think you'll all be just as sick as I am if we find it is nothing but a hungry hussy throwing herself at every stinking smokestack that's offered. There was good years and some bad ones, and some we won't recall. But I say out loud, we was mighty proud of Governor Tom McCall. From Astoria to Newport, and up to Multnomah Falls. From 66 to 74, our governor was Tom McCall.